welcome back to our channel so today we are going, going to, to recycle a paper used paper you can see we have some xerox the old xerox whichever we have used it look at that the old xerox so we are going to recycle this into the paper plain paper even we can do the texture on that paper this is a homemade process it nothing needs but the ingredients such as these we are going to need is mixer to grind the mixture it's the color and the scissor a stainer it can be of any shape and the used papers this paper we are going to cut strip wise lots of strips okay lots of strips after the lots of strips are cut out you can see like this we are going to cut them again like this like this we are going to cut and we are going to fill them like this in container we are going to soak this all pieces of paper for more than 12 hours this mixture we are going to soak whole night it's overnight so this is the mixture we have added some uh, food coloring too and we are just staining this so we have stained and so we are going to grind it in the mixer first we are putting some after that we will do another one so we are adding some food coloring now we are the finest mixture we have made in the mixer you can see now we are going to add this mixture to the water so here we have taken the soaked water and added some water in this container now i am going to add this whole mixture to this water we have to separate the water for making the mixture more minute so i have added the whole mixture to this container now this is a fine stainer you can see it is very fine now i am going to mix this first and then i am going to dip this you can see keep it while the water is staining now this is our paper you can see you can see the paper now we are going to transfer this paper we can't touch this because whenever we touch this the whole texture get damaged so this paper i'm going to keep for a while and then i'm going to keep this or transfer this on a fine cloth now after a while i'm going to transfer this to the cloth like this you can see the paper has transferred to the cloth now this like this we can make lots of texture on it with the various shapes and all and then we are going to leave it till tomorrow's morning or afternoon it is going to be the best fine cardboard sheet paper okay you can see this is going to be a good paper we can use it so like this we are going to make lots and lots with the stainer and the container we can make lots of paper you can see after staining a while then we are all going to transfer it to the cloth very fine cloth and this i am i am going to leave it for a single day in the sunlight and it will become a fine paper so i have some cookie cutter after a while when this paper will get into this then i will apply some texture with this cookie cutter the best way to recycle paper at home we everyone should try this to avoid each and every calamity and global warming it's fine 
like this we can make lots of texture with the fork then i will show you that after this is dry we can cut the paper our whatever we wish to it's whatever shape we wish welcome back here are our dried papers homemade papers with the each and every texture on it they are dried enough in a sunlight so you can cut them in whatever shape you would like now look at that texture the thinnest paper look at this we can cut them in a perfect shape but look at that texture Difference. So these are this. We can cut them. Cutting, you can see here. And this is the waste. We can also recycle this again. So this is our final result. For watching, please like, share, and subscribe. Bye.